welcome back to Aging Adventure. We are in our final state of our huge road trip and join us as we explore part of Connecticut. Goodbye, Rhode Island. Yeah. <laughs> bye, bye, bye. We are on our way to our last state that's new to us. Yes, to sleep in. We've driven through it. Well, not Marley, but. Which is? Connecticut. We're headed to Witch Meadow Lake Campground in Salem, Connecticut. <laughs> um, there's some hiking, state parks nearby with waterfalls. There's a castle. Um, it's also going to be in a heat wave, like 95. Melt so we it, might melt. We might melt, but we're gonna have fun. Yes, we are. All right. So Marley just dropped her milk. That is an important issue. Melt so out! <laughs> I will get that and we'll see you in Connecticut. Woo! So today we are going to the Gillette Castle State Park. Um, four of us are going to do a tour. Um, we explained to Tegan several times that it is not, no one's dressed up like in costume. Um, she'll probably still be disappointed, but we're really yeah. excited. Um, at this campground this weekend, Witch Meadow Lake, they have Christmas in July. So they have tons of activities for the kids. So after the castle, we'll come back here and see what we get into. Yep. And when in doubt, there's the pool. Yeah, that was a big hit yesterday, so we will see how it goes today. Marley, what is that? <laughs> it's a choo choo train. Yeah. No, we can't ride it. This was the castle built by William Gillette. William Gillette in 1919 for $1 million. Which I can only imagine how much that is today. They said $13 million, but that seems low. And he played Sherlock Holmes over 1,300 times. He was an actor. He actually quit acting and then worked on building a railroad system in his backyard. So there's a railroad system here. It's about three miles long. It's got tunnels and bridges. And he actually built his own uh, train engines to run the railroad. So it's kind of crazy. He, he, uh, he built them to look like steam engines, but they weren't. They had batteries in them. Um, we were reading, which we thought was really cool too. We got a while. Yes, it was. So here is his Grand Central Station for the trains. For the trains, so that means this train must be down here somewhere. Yeah. Well, they say it was, they restored it, so they fixed it. You mean it was broken? 
Yeah. They picked it and they turned it in. Yeah, they built electric trains with batteries and they built batteries. And he made them look like steam engines. Yeah. Can you go make mommy? No, there's no train coming, but it's a good thing view. Yeah, it's a good view of the river. Yeah, it's a good view of the river. No, there's no train coming, but it's a good view of the river. And the ferry. Go down here to the ferry. Here, I'll pick you up. Oh, it just goes just straight across the river. I was wondering where it went. With a car. See, T, that's a, the, the, the ferry. Hey, Tiggy, come here and look what's on top of the train station to keep the birdies away. Come here, closer to mommy. Bunny. No, it's not a bunny. What animal is that, Marmars? T, what animal is it? Cat. A cat keeps the birdies off the top. Kind of like how Grandma and Pap put uh, stuffed toys up on top of their rafters. Yep. Awesome. That is a must do. Yeah. Uh, I geeked out at the castle. I watched the video. I read all the stuff. It was amazing. Yeah, that was that was really cool. Um, also, there is air conditioning inside. <laughs> Fun fact. Which was awesome because it was uh, a little warm out again today. But so to it was nice to know. get inside and get some air. Uh, but definitely a must do. Check it out if you're in yeah. Connecticut. T, what did you think? Too hot outside. It was the top of the pool. What did you think of the castle? <laughs> oh, I watched a movie when we were at the campground. No, what did you think of the castle? I, I think he had a million kitties. He did. He, he, do you remember how many cats he had? Fifteen, and at they had at least fifteen. At least fifteen. So the girls were excited because they got to see all the pictures of the kitties and yeah, the cat the sculptures. He does love cats. Yeah. Did Did you think it was cool? Yeah. Yeah. I think I like the sculptures of the cat. And anyway, me and Marley always play cat. You do always play kitties. Did you like his cat table? Right, they yeah. did. So we're at a beautiful site in Witch Meadow Lake Campground in Connecticut. And we actually forgot to make a video yesterday because we were so hot after setting up, we just ran down to the pool and jumped in. But it's an awesome little site. You can see here, the girls are already eating lunch. So we went on there. Let me alone my eating lunch. Let you alone while you're eating lunch, that's fine. And it's got a little community fire pit out here. And a really nice little area. Good morning. Hello. Um, today's our last day in Connecticut. Yep. Um, so today we're going to Devil's Hop Yard State Park, which is known for waterfalls. Um, and we're doing a really short hike. We're kind of long hiked out. It's supposed to be really hot today. It's also super hot. And muggy. Um, it's 0.4 loop. 
We're not even bringing the hiking backpack. We have water bottles. The girls will walk it. Yeah. Um, and then we're going to maybe get some ice cream and meet up with some friends from high school that live up here, so it should be exciting. Yeah, we haven't seen them in like 10 years, so it's gonna be fun to meet up with them. They uh, they have- Twins. Twins, yeah. Yep, a boy, boy and, a girl, and a girl. And they've never met our kiddos, so it'll be, it'll be a really good time. And then we're gonna come back, uh, probably have some quiet time, let T splash around the pool if there's time, and then there's a one-man band tonight to celebrate the Christmas in July that I'm sure we'll experience while we let the girls play at the playground. So, so should be a fun-filled day. It's our last day. Yeah, it is. It's been, it's been fun. It has been. Let's have a good day. Sounds good. Hey, Mar Mars. This was very confusing. Yeah. Hey, T, was this, was this trail well marked? No. No, it, it could use some help with marking trails. Calcium deposit. From the rocks, it's kind of turning into um. So. Yeah, I don't remember either. So we're up super early today because this is it. It's time to go home. We're ready. Yeah. It's been a great trip. It's been so much fun. Had its moments of insanity <laughs> and panic and mayhem, but. Yeah. The girls are very much ready to go home and so see, are the cats. see everybody and the cats are done. They did not want to, even Corduroy didn't want to get in the truck today. Yeah, so just... it's time. We're going to try to make it home as long as everybody is good. If and we not, get around New York City. Yeah, if not, we'll we, stop yeah. and we'll have an extra day, but yeah. this should be it. We should be, should be able to make it home. About eight hours, seven hours. Yeah, somewhere, somewhere in, in there. there. So it's going to be long, but luckily there's two of us. Yep. So next got... time we see you, hopefully we'll be in the Outer, the Outer Banks. Banks. Until next time. Bye. The disaster I wanted on video. There's no nozzle. Ah! Nope, abort, abort, <laughs> abort. <laughs> Connecticut was a breath of fresh air for us. It was amazing compared to the last two states we were at. Um, the girls had a great time here. It was more of a family atmosphere. The wooded sites were wonderful. The pool was great. Um, the staff was friendly. And it was just a really nice way to end our trip. So big shout out to Witch Meadow Lake Campground. We'll would definitely try that again in the future. Thank you for coming along on our 20 day adventure with us. I know it took us a long time to get these videos up. We were fighting with new jobs and computer issues. So it definitely took us a long time and hopefully this summer takes us a lot less time because we have a 26 day trip planned of the whole Southeast US. And we hope that you join us and watch our videos and comment and let us know places to visit. Thank you.